Shalom everyone. I hope you're all doing well. Today uh, we all know the story of Hannah, the wife of Elkanah, who did not bear the child for a long period of time. Uh, here the scripture says in the uh, first Samuel chapter number one and verse number five. The Lord had closed her womb. Lord want his people to be blessed. But why did Lord close her womb? She might have prayed for the uh, long time to bear the son. She might have been depressed because she was unable to bear a son. But why did Lord close her womb? It is for a purpose. The will of the God upon her was to submit the child that she's bearing to the Almighty God. Unless she prayed according to the will, in the verse number 11 she prayed. She made a vow saying, Lord Almighty, if you only look on your servant's misery and remember me and not forget your servant but give her a son, then I will give him to the Lord for all the days of, her, of his life and no razor will ever be used on his head. Here the prayer that she made was according to the will of the God. Hence she was blessed with the son and he, she named him Samuel which is in the verse number 20. So in the course of time, Hannah became pregnant and gave birth to a son. She named him Samuel saying, because I asked the Lord for him. You might be asking the Lord for something, but it might not be in the will of the Father. Today we might be praying for something, but that prayer might not be in the will of the Father. As, as we uh, uh, meditate on this word, she aligned her prayer to the will of the God. We might be praying uh, different things about different uh, situations, but that might not be in the will of the Father. When your prayers get aligned to the will of the Father, the Father answers to your prayer. As Hannah has prayed according to the will of the Father, that uh, she will bear a son and uh, she would give him to the Lord for all the days of his life and no razor will ever be used on his head. Here the Spirit of the Lord has leaded her to pray according to the will of the God. Today we might be praying for many things but the prayer was, might not have been aligned to the will of the Father. I hope that today as Hannah have prayed to the uh, God according to his will and aligned her prayer to the God according to his will, let us all align our prayers to the will of the God so that we would get the answers and glorify the Jesus Christ's name. Amen.